talk about how to develop in-hand manipulation skills as one of the prerequisites for writing. In-hand manipulation skills are essential for the handwriting process because they allow the child to move the pencil from palm to finger, make needed adjustments to the pencil for writing, and turn the pencil in order to use its eraser at its opposite end all with one hand. Some children may present with the delayed in-hand manipulation skills. For some others, they may not be practiced or learned. So, it is important to develop their foundation skills necessary for writing rather than forcing them to write. Here are some simple activities that helps your child to improve their in-hand manipulation skills as a foundation for writing. It's the ability to move and hold the objects within one hand. These skills are divided into three main categories. Translation, Rotation and Shift Now what is Translation Skills? It's the ability to hold and move the objects from palm to the fingertips and vice versa within one hand. An example of translation is moving coins from palm to the fingertips to put inside a slot. Putting coins in a piggy bank, stringing beads, Picking up small objects from the table one by one with fingers and ask the child to hold the bead in the palm. Making paper balls and sticking. Sticking chunkies or buttons on a paper. Picking up small beads from a bowl of rice. Hiding small objects inside the play dough and ask the child to look for them. Putting beads through a pipe cleaner. Getting coins out of a purse. Next one is shift. It is the ability to move the objects between the fingers. Examples of shift is when you use your fingertips to separate two pieces of paper that are stuck together or when you move your fingertips to the bottom of a pen to get ready to write. These are said to be pen walks or pencil walks. Practicing turning pages in a book, giving card games, practicing pencil walks, walk your child's fingertips up and down a pencil, Playing with pipe cleaners, mastic crafts, cotton swap painting, picking up buttons or beads from a table using tweezers, lacing or threading through large holes on a cardboard. There are two types of in-hand manipulation skills when it comes to the rotation, simple and complex. Simple rotation is the ability to roll the objects between the thumb and the fingertips. An example of simple rotation is using your thumb and fingertips to open a small jar. And complex rotation is the ability to turn the objects end over end within one hand. An example of complex rotation is flipping a pencil over in one hand to use the eraser at its opposite end. Practicing putting on and taking off small leaves or caps, playing with the shape sorter, playing with clay, doing piece puzzles, giving the child a container of nuts and balls, providing wooden blocks with alphabets, numbers and images, stacking dice or blocks, playing with Legos or building blocks. Give pencil with eraser on the opposite end and ask them to use both ends alternately. I hope these suggestions are helpful. Do try these activities at home if your child struggles with writing. If you have any further concerns, please contact the Occupational Therapy Department at Pratna. Thank you.